there are only two assumptions of correlation. The first one is that the sampling is random. You'll notice that one of the assumptions we saw in other tests that the two X and Y items are not correlated is not an assumption here because a correlation is actually what we are assuming in this particular statistical test. There is, however, an assumption of bivariate normal distribution. That means that both the X and the Y distributions are separately normal, but that they are also, you could sort of say, normal together. The scatter plot of the two is elliptical, and the stretching out of the elliptical is a linear XY relationship. There is a library called MVN that allows you to test for multivariate normality in R. The MVM installation is rather large. It takes a while to run. So don't wait until the last minute to try to run it. Once you have it installed, however, it's not that hard to use. The test that you do is simply the MVN function. There are a couple of parameters that you have to pass in. You can see what they are here. The result of this analysis you can have shown in two ways. You can have it do a normal quantile or QQ plot. You can also have it show you histograms. I'm going to have it do it both ways. Let's try the QQ plot first. Here's the QQ plot of the percent symptoms and also the percent wearing masks. It's not too bad. If we have it run the histograms, also doesn't look too bad. The actual result of the MVN analysis will show up and I can see that it is multivariate normal. The p-value does not fall below 0 0.05, so it does not differ significant from multivariate normal.